My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. Got a beautiful Packard 1939 Club Coupe. I'm telling you, the restoration's outstanding. This is just one of those cars you just want to look at and admire, but it is just as roadworthy, uh, just as capable of being driven as, as it is beautiful. This is from the Claude Oak Estate Collection. We just purchased 25 cars uh, from his estate. He kept a full-time mechanic servicing his cars because he said he wanted to be able to drive any car at any time. And this is one of them. It starts right up. It runs so smooth. Uh, car's fantastic. Go to volocars.com. That's where you can uh, look at all the pictures, read the description. That's where you can find prices and finance payments with all the cars that we have for sale. That's at volocars.com. If you enjoy the YouTube channel, click on uh, subscribe and then click on the bell icon. That way you'll be notified as the new ones are posted. But for right now, join me. Let's go for a spin. Yeah, I tell you what, this is one of the nicest cars I have in our collection. And it's not the least expensive car here, but it's at the bottom end of things. It's the Packard 6, so it's not the big V12 or Victoria. Uh, but what a beautiful car. It's still a Packard, but anyone can appreciate the workmanship, workmanship in, in the restoration. And take this to any shop, it's going to cost three times what I'm asking for the car to restore it to this quality. Um, our Mustangs and Camaros are bringing a lot more money than this one right here. But anyway, it was body off frame at one time, the restoration. Underneath is really nice, clean chassis, the frame, the suspension, the components, the rear end, all of it's nice and clean and tidy. Uh, you can take any bolt off with a wrench. It's not old and rusted. Um, looking up at the motor, it's clean. The three-speed transmission's clean. Um, I don't know what the first year was for independent front suspension, but this has independent front suspension. Uh, that was something that was relatively new at that time. The exhaust is clean. The fuel tank does look like it's a custom. It's a polished stainless steel tank they probably had made for this car. So underneath the car is super nice. Now the body's fantastic. Uh, all straight clean metal. It opens from either side. We'll open that in a little while. The headlight buckets, the Packard grill, all of this is really nice. It's straight. That's called the Goddess of Speed hood ornament. And this looks like it's a really nice original example of one. Uh, but the body, all real nice. I don't see any damage. There's no rust, no dents, no, no body work showing through. All of this is super fine. Yeah, I don't see any issues. Like down here where they may be rusted or worked on, it's all nice and smooth. Unfortunately, there is a pretty good scratch right here. Um, it is a solid color, so we get that... Uh, go to a shop and get that color match properly, that can be touched up fairly easily. Uh, it's the club coupe because it has jump seats in the back. Uh, but the roof is excellent. All this is excellent. Fenders, and the whole car is metal. Fits beautifully. All this is in really nice shape. Beautiful, nice. I don't see any issues with the body. Couple little imperfections in the paint here, some little bumps in the paint. The body's excellent. All the metal is excellent. The welts, welting they call it, between the fenders, that's all real nice. All the rubber gaskets around the windows are real nice. Has a radio, which is rare back then. Has a little red uh, plastic at the top of the antenna. Split windshield. Again, the rubber is real nice. All the chrome is really nice. Has a nice louvered hood. Black wall tires, that's correct. White walls are put on by the dealers. This is the reproduction. Uh, black wall tires, it would be on there. The wheels are all restored, all new trim. Bumpers are re-chromed. The bumper brackets are painted. 
Headlight uh, glass is excellent. It's got the chrome louvered grill. All the glass has probably been replaced because it's all crystal clear. Uh, these back windows do pop out. Door handles are real nice. Yeah, paint's super nice. I mean, I'm sure other than that scratch, there's probably a couple other insignificant flaws, but uh, overall, the outside of this car looks fantastic. So let's see what the inside of the car looks like. We're going to see a beautifully restored trunk compartment. The latches work properly. It's all painted very nicely. The rubber weather strip is replaced. And look what a nice job they did with this carpet, the bound edges. It even smells new in here. So it has a matching spare tire. It's a new reproduction, never been used. Underneath here, it's got the rubber mat and uh, liner on the bottom. Uh, it's a beautiful trunk compartment. You know, you pull into a car show with a car like this, you just want to be a little different. You want to drive an old car, but you want something a little more impressive than a Model A. I mean, here's your chance to buy a, a show-winning Packard. Look at the uh, door jams, the latches, the weather strips are pristine. But this upholstery is amazing. Inside this car is just, uh, I'm in love with it. It's the matching upholstery on the doors and seats, and it is pristine. All the stitching, there's no wrinkles, the cushion is real nice. Now it has the painted on wood grain that's also in beautiful shape all over the trim. Uh, all the chrome and clock and knobs and uh, everything's really nice looking. It has a day night mirror. Has a glove box, liner's real nice. Looks like they took the fuse out of the clock, so it probably works. They took the fuse out so it doesn't kill the battery. And this is the uh, handy shift. This is when it, it was an option to get it on the column. These were still on the floor, so that's uh, the optional handy shift. Steering wheel's real nice. There's some small cracks, more of a cosmetic flaw, nothing you gotta worry about. Then down on the floor, a beautiful carpet like the trunk it does have these nice carpeted mats it's not stained or dirty oh horn works uh jump seats in the back i think that's what makes it the club coupe you got these seats they fold up i'm sure they fold up all the way i would think but uh so i knew there was a trick to getting the seats to fold up this here opens up, push the seat in there, fold that down, voila, seats do fold up. That's why they're called jump seats. All upholstered, it's called taupe twill fabric. And then the headliner is called broadcloth. It's a nice soft cloth upholstery. And uh, watch that dome light works, see that? I knew it would work too. Most cars like, oh, that ain't gonna work. But this car is so nice. When I flipped the switch earlier, I'm like, I, I bet you that's gonna work. So interior is absolutely beautiful. You're gonna be sitting inside that car looking around and it's just gonna give you a good feeling. So it has the Packard tag. The firewall is all painted nicely. And you can see the motor compartment has been apart and restored. This is not a spray can special. Um, the generator, the steering, the starter, the horns, the distributor, all of it looks to be in really wonderful condition. All the wiring. It's their six cylinder motor, bulletproof motor I read online. When you come around, let's look at both sides since we got it open called the center hinged hood. The oil bath air cleaner. It has the correct downdraft carburetor, a carter. Fuel pump, fuel line, everything looks proper. Looks real nice.
the light blend says Packard right on it. Wonderful car. I just, I appreciate this car. The, the fit and finish and quality is amazing. Again, just going to get ice cream, going to your car show, cruise nights. It's a Packard. People don't need to know that you paid less for this than uh, what a Mustang goes for. So very impressive car from the Claude O collection. So far, I've been very pleased with everything we've gotten from him. Go to volocars.com. I gave you my impression, but talk to the salesman with your questions and concerns. They'll help you the best they can. If you enjoy the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on the bell icon so you can be the first to see the next one posted. Thanks for watching.